This is going to be a video tutorial on how to use the eraser tool in Adobe Illustrator. I'm going to jump over to an artboard here. I have some shapes on here. Uh, first thing you need to do if you're going to work on a shape or on text, you need to select it first. The eraser tool is located in the tools panel. If I hold my left mouse button down on it, it brings up, it also brings up the scissors tool and the knife tool. They're all located in the same area. The keyboard shortcut for the eraser tool is shift E. I'm going to go ahead and select my eraser tool. You can do a variety of things with the eraser tools. You could, uh, I can hold down my left mouse button and drag all the way through a shape or object. And now I have created, let me click off it and back on it. I have created two objects by just dragging through it. I can recolor them differently. You can also, I'm going to select this bottom shape here. Always got to make sure you have your uh, shape that you're working on selected. I'm going to go back to my eraser tool. I can increase the size of my eraser by using the uh, right bracket key. The right bracket key increases it and the left bracket key decreases it. And I can just completely erase parts of my shapes or objects like so. And what it has done, it has simply redrawn the uh, path. I have freehandedly, you know, just erased part of it. And it's just redrawing the path is what it's doing. The path now goes this way. Another thing you can do other than dividing objects, if you don't have the uh, shape selected and you draw through it, it'll disappear. You got to make sure that you have it selected, then go to the eraser tool. You could draw through it. You could erase parts of it. You can also do it on text too. I'm going to go back to my selection tool. I'm going to select this text down here. And to do it on text, I need to first select it, then I need to right click, and I need to go to create outlines. Now I'll click off of it and back on it. I will go to my eraser tool now. I'm going to bring down the size of my eraser by using the left bracket key. And now my text now has all these anchor points on it because it's now an outline. And I can draw through it. Go back to my selection tool. I'm going to click off. Another thing I need to do is I need to ungroup it now because now it's all grouped. I need to ungroup now. Then I can select portions of my text. Be kind of artsy with it. But that is the eraser tool. You can divide objects or shapes. You can uh, as well as text. You can uh, erase portions of it. But that's how to use the eraser tool. Thanks for watching.